my finished illuminated border number three using stencils and stamps. I think the stencils were fun to do, but here again, I don't think I would do an entire book of them. I might do one page of them, and I was a little bit disappointed with how they were coming out. Maybe it was the media I was using. I'm not sure, but I eventually went over them with my stamps. I might play some more with doing stencils on illuminated borders, but you never know until you try. Now, I was much happier doing the FW ink and stamping clocks on the background. Aren't those cool? I like those a lot. And I like these. This went much faster. I could see me doing several pages in a book using this technique. But like I said, you never know until you try. The stenciling technique, you, you have the issue with taping it off and making sure that you get enough media on your sponge and you have the issue with smearing it it's just it's really just too much trouble if you want to do several pages if you ask me so i really made this kind of like an art journal page the stencil that i used was a thinobar scissor stencil that was gifted to me last year by marianne mcmillan thank you marianne i really do like that stencil the stamp I'm not sure who created the stamp. It was gifted to me by Annie V. I'm using my Happy Mail, hey. <laughs> so, yes, I do like these FW inks with the stamps over them. This is a quick, easy technique if you want a fun border in your journal. Now, I w don't know if I would really call this a traditional illuminated border. It's more of just a border on your page. You know, illuminated borders traditionally in history are very floral and organic. This is just a quick technique that I'm doing in my Mornings with Mary art journal page. Happy with it in the end. And look at, here's Penelope, and she's holding the crochet hook here. I put it right in underneath of this red fabric. And the crochet hook is holding my little boho bead. <laughs> Fun. Thank you, Penelope. Thank you for watching, and... I will see you tomorrow morning.